So buying at a real estate auction online could not be easier. The platform we use is very, very similar to eBay, um, but unlike eBay where you may be buying secondhand Levi's, with our platform, we're selling and you would be buying real estate for potentially many tens of thousands of pounds. So there's some key rules that you really should be adopting. So what are those rules? Well, the first rule I would say is you really should be inspecting the property. Now we produce tours, video tours, 360 tours, dolls house views, uh, floor plans and the like for houses that we sell at auction. But I would encourage everybody wherever possible to still conduct a physical viewing of the property. It's really only when you get inside, when you see the property in the flesh and you can have a, an even greater inspection of it that you can really see if there are any flaws or any positives and you can get to see the neighbourhood. Looking around the neighbourhood can be really important. Look at the legal pack. Now, every property that's sold at auction is sold with a legal pack. Now, most people buying at our auctions are not trained lawyers or trained conveyancers, so we would say to everybody, um, get the legal pack, download it, or get your solicitor to download it. Most solicitors now will just access the legal pack via our website, via our link. They're used to doing that. They will look at the legal pack for you and they can give it a clean bill of health or raise queries if they feel appropriate. And occasionally they will say, don't touch this property. They may charge you a small amount of money to do that, but it's absolutely money well spent. Plan your strategy. Have a property in mind or properties. Ideally have several properties, but however many you've got in mind, stick to those properties. So you might be bidding for just one property, you might be bidding for several properties and you only want to buy one of them, that's fine. But if you get outbid on every single one of those properties, don't just then suddenly switch on to another one. Have a plan and stick to it. If you lose all the properties you're going for, then you can come back and fight another day. Finances would be the next thing I would say. We can put you in touch with, as, as other people will be able to put you in touch with, mortgage advisors who specialise in either buy to let or commercial loans, or indeed bridging finance. So there are loads of options available, but talk to these financiers in advance of bidding at auction. It's much less stressful to get it all sorted out uh, before you start putting your hand up virtually on the online auction. So make sure you do your research. Research is incredibly important. Whether you're looking to buy a property to sell it on, or are you looking to rent it out, do as much research as you can. Talk to local agents, talk to the experts, look at the, the portals like Rightmove and so on. Find out what prices uh, properties are selling for or what they're renting for. But do that research, it'll be absolutely invaluable. So bidding is one thing I would say to have a think about. I would always advise everybody, set yourself a maximum price and stick to it. You may want to go just one bit above fine if it's really neck and neck, but what you've got to be careful is not to get caught up in a bidding war. In a strong market, it can be very tempting to buy on tomorrow's prices. Have all that in mind. There's no shame in being outbid and walking away. There'll be another deal to do another day. And then lastly, I would say just enjoy yourself. Uh, buying at auction, whether it's on eBay or whether you're buying real estate for, for many tens or even hundreds of thousands of pounds, should be fun. Um, that's part of the reason why we do it. So try and enjoy yourself. Um, yes, you're, it's a serious business in that, you know, you've done all your research, you've got your maximum price, but just absolutely go for it. Try and enjoy the experience and uh, very best of luck to you. So I've given my do's and don'ts for buying at auction, some key rules if you like, some golden rules. If you do have any further queries though, anything that I haven't covered that you think would be really useful, please do get in touch with us. Mm -hmm.